Hey Collective, it's your girl Stace from Divine Goddess Tarot. Listen, I really wasn't planning on getting on here, but my God, my ears are ringing like crazy. And I'm trying to figure out, I'm like, is it because I got a cold? <laughs> or is there a message, you know, that's trying to come through? So... Here I am. Let's see what comes out. Um, I remember that time is fluid, so whenever you see this message, it's when you're meant to see it. It's a general reading. May not resonate, resonate with everyone, so please only take what resonates and leave the rest. I'm trying to figure out what deck I'm supposed to be using, but it's like, it's just persistent. And very loud. <clears throat> let's see if I can get through this. Yeah, let's see what's going on, Spirit. What's this message? Oh, excuse me. Thank you, Spirit. Spirit, what's this message for my collective? Please and thank you. What is this message trying to come through, Spirit? Ooh. Three of Wands. <laughs> Someone's going in a new direction, making a decision to go in a new direction. You need to make a decision to go into a new direction. It's time to move on now. That's what I'm hearing. It's time to move. It's time to, yeah. It's time to move. Make a decision. Two of Cups. Choice. It could be in love. It could be something that you're very passionate about. It could be choosing yourself. Uh, choosing somewhere that you want to be. That, that you care about. You know what I mean? Your passion. Wow. That is a ring. Nine of Swords. You're up in your head about something. <laughs> Something's keeping you up at night. Something's got you worried, stressed, and anxiety, anxious about choosing someone, going towards an individual, making a choice. Could be about a lover. But it's got you anxious, real anxious and stressed. Like you're not you're not sure or you feel like you're doing something that you don't want to do. <laughs> By going in this direction. Spirit, what's this message? Six of Wands. Wow. Somebody's moving away to calmer waters. Somebody's feeling like they should cut their losses and just move on. <laughs> Somebody could have a lot of regrets about some things, maybe. <sighs> this could have been a marriage. Somebody could be deciding that they need to move away from a relationship or separation. Maybe there's a child involved. But somebody's really anxious about this and um, could be like, Really contemplating into minds, maybe up at night, not sure about what they should do. Or this is somebody knowing what they should do, but but they haven't done it. They know they need to cut their losses, take the baby or the children and move and leave out of a situation. What's this message? The magician. Someone's trying to find a way, find a new a new opportunity, a new path. Somebody could be waiting for their ships to come in. Somebody's ships could be coming in. Somebody could have options on which direction they need to be going in. But somebody definitely know they need to choose. It could be between lovers. Someone could like 
have two people around them, maybe one person they have a, a, a child with, and there's a new person, and somebody feels regret for wanting to leave the person that they have a child with for a new opportunity. Mm -hmm. Yep, they, they, somebody could, you know, have been up, you know, really thinking about this, weighing the pros and cons, trying to follow their heart, trying to do what's right, what they feel is right, what's best for them. Thank you, Spirit. What's this message? Seven of Wands. Someone's very protective, very guarded at this time with, with uh, what they're manifesting. They're keeping it to themselves. Well, the sun. But I think that's about to be revealed. feel like somebody's been keeping what they've been um, working on or trying to manifest. They've been protecting it, keeping it um, under guard, you know. Not telling people. Keeping nosy people away. Pro I'm get the, energy, the protective energy, the guarded energy, the... Huh. I feel like, okay, this union could be protected. Whatever this is, the sun, there it is, came right on back out. <coughs> I feel like you're protected. <coughs> Seven of Swords. Deception. Seeing something for what it is, something coming to light. Maybe something that you tried to keep hidden. Or someone tried to keep hidden. Let's see what's going on here, Spirit. Ace of Wands. Yeah, this new opportunity, this new beginning. You've been struggling with this for some time. <clears throat> yeah, trying to decide if you should make this move or not. Um, keeping your your motivations and your um, your thoughts to yourself, you know, praying on things, waiting for the right time, the right situation to present itself, and still yet and still struggling with releasing and letting go of some things as well. Cutting ties, I'm hearing. Five of Swords. Hmm. Yeah, you kept it. You keeping it quiet because you know that there's people that's trying to block you, trying to come against you, that will try to uh, keep you from walking away from a situation, from surrendering and moving on and creating a new opportunity for yourself. It's like you had to keep it to yourself because you know that you had others that were trying to come against you. Trying to keep you from moving forward. Trying to keep you from manifesting whatever this new opportunity is for yourself. <sighs> Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, look at that. Seven of Swords. Yeah, having to keep it to yourself because you know... I don't know. I really don't see how somebody can steal your opportunities... But they can definitely create obstacles, you know what I'm saying, or, or blockages, or try to create some kind of resistance towards your forward movement, you know what I mean? However they do that, what we got here? We got judgment, the five of pentacles and the six of pentacles in reverse. Yep. Judgment's being called in a situation. You call judgment on a situation. No more um, depending on other people. This is why you kept this to yourself. You know? No more having to depend on other people to, to breadcrumb you. You know what I'm saying? It's like no more feeling like you're left out in the cold. Right? You surrendered that. You surrendered that. You healing from that. You know, you're working on your new opportunity, your new beginning. Yeah, you call judgment. On anybody that was uh, 
breadcrumbing you, not treating you equally, not including you, anything like that you call judgment on it. And people see that with the sun right in the middle of the reading. Yeah. The sun is also revealing that you have a new beginning in spite of all the obstacles that you have come against. Nine of Wands, the wounded warrior, I'm telling you. This is how people see you as a fighter, as a warrior, as somebody that fights for what you believe. Fight, listen, the Empress, all right? Fight for what you believe and where you, where you fit in society. You know, you know your worth. You know who you are. Queen of Cups, you're a very loving, caring, and nurturing person. Yes, sir. Yes, you are. And you know that it's necessary for you to make a decision to, to move away from this kind of energy. You know it's time. It's something you've been working on. You've been manifesting. You've been weighing out the pros and the cons. And now you're ready to take that leap of faith. Alright y'all, I'm running out of air here Alright You ready to take that leap of faith Alright, I'll see you guys Alright, if I can get out another one I'll get out another one But in the meantime, I'm gonna go rest And take care of me Alright, peace